Space Tour because thanks to the summer event, I was able to remake the entire base and finish it. Because surprisingly, we got stage related stuff, and this character is called Popstar. Now, Popstar is an original character of mine. In short, I just call her Pop. Um, but she is basically part of my powering uh, books, and she is a very interesting character because she comes from a world where uh, kids aren't usually get to grow to become adults. Like the adults there are actually thousands of thousands of years old, and kids usually get um, sacrificed to the elders to get all their powers. Because this is a world where the children are the most powerful, they have really powerful abilities and the others want all those powers to themselves. So Pop is one of those that gets the chance to escape. Uh, she escapes and comes to Earth and she joins the powering. Uh, but she's a very truthful character all considering. Uh, even though she can lose control sometimes, it can get possessed by one of the elders because this is what happens to basically all the children there, those that tends to leave or just get taken over by an elder but she managed to control herself for the most part and she's still a child so she's like 12 years old so she's very young um, and she very much loves music when she came to earth and learned about music uh, she also found her own voice and she's basically a singer so this bass is pretty much uh, what would it be if she was famous and it starts with her stage and everything it's called uh, pop star show or something like that so yeah, I'll probably check it out before <laughs> I upload the video but yeah so this is the base uh, this is pop star so you see she's not very human uh, she has a tails so this is mostly the DCL design uh, but if you want to see the actual design uh, for the book this is what I came up with for the book um, so this is the style so she does have a tail regardless because she's not human after all she's from a special planet so she has all the tattoos and whatever um the tattoos basically pretty much say that she's possessed uh but once she's not possessed uh, you see them not shining too much like you can barely see them when she's in control so so they are there but if they're not shining and stuff that means she's not possessed at the moment this is kind of lower thing. Uh, but we're gonna look at the base. Here you have an access to the hotel, but obviously just leading to somewhere else. So they got to see the hotel because you know it's still in DC also. We gotta use the DC stuff. Uh, as you can see, uh, one of her abilities, she's making the place looks like um, it's under the cosmic skies, but. In reality, they're inside the building, so <laughs> here's the stage, this is where she shows. I wish we had that thing in the mouth with actual microphone, so that would be cool. And I'm missing a microphone, uh, <laughs> but it's okay. Uh, I'll probably edit with Valentine's event, but it's not a big deal, because uh, the base is pretty much done. And people are sitting here to watch the show, and you got this. I, I'm gathering too dark to actually say that, but... Part of the stage. I wanted to put the long ones, but it didn't fit in, so this is what it is. Some screens over here. Now I'm going to backstage basically. This is still some posters and stuff, uh, but I'm right going backstage. So you have uh, some merchandise stuff over here if you want to get them. And some statues and stuff because she's rich. <laughs> um, very rich. Yeah, this is the life of famous uh, singer, I guess. <laughs> oh, and all these posters. Basically, upstairs here is the bedroom. We got this. And her bed. And a hot tub because she's rich. <laughs> One of the signs to show she's very rich and enjoying her life. And on the other side here, you can see all her outfits. Like these two are show outfits, and this one needs a, a superhero outfit. So 
You need to make where she uses her makeup and says everything. Yeah. I thought about adding some of the closets from Justice League Dark Horse, but I didn't want to turn it into like a magician inspired face because that made me think a lot of Madam Spade face and they're both from Powerwing, so I don't want the two of them to have the same base. Okay, so we're going downstairs. Yeah, more. Here is a bar, basically. Um, she has a bar downstairs where she sits with their friends, as famous people. So they're all coming to hang out here, playing the piano, this food and everything she needs. There's a bar, like I said. Here they can play together. And all their trophies. And of course, it's not closing properly. <laughs> uh, so when you come here, there's this door. It's hiding the all the things you want all over the years, all the trophies. So you can open it. Let me go in here. There's okay, someone here already looking at the <laughs> trophies. Uh, but yeah. It's more protected now more than anything, so nobody steals the trophies. Uh, but yeah, this is her show base. Uh, I'm really happy with how it turned out. I did it, like, I decided to change the base to this a few days ago, actually. And I was really happy with the idea, and I was like, sure, why not? It looks really cool, fit the story, and it looks way better than what her old base used to look, so... I'm just happy I got the chance to really update that and uh, take it to the place where it really fits the character. So thank you so much for watching. That was uh, Popstar's stage show base. <laughs> uh, and yeah, I'll try to do more videos actually when I do the base tours where I talk so I can explain about the bases a little. Uh, but yeah, if you like the base, let me know below in the comments below don't forget you can donate five dollars or fifteen dollars if you want to get more than one base tour and i'll show your bases this year for extra life uh so you can check out my extra life page for that and yeah i'll see you in the next one